Welcome back kindergarten scholars and today we're going to work on some more rhythms. Now we've got some eighth notes held together by a bar here. We've got a quarter note and then over at the end we've got a quarter rest. Remember that when we get to the quarter rest we still have to count the beat where we counted in our head. Does anyone know what beat this is? That's right, it's four. So you've got beat one with these two eighth notes, one and, then two, then three, and then four is our quarter rest. So we would count one and two, three, Let's take a look at the first measure. Time signature is 4-4, four, four, which means there are four beats in a measure, as we already figured out from that last measure. So the first measure is going to go 1 and 2, 3 and 4. Let's do that together. 1 and 2. Ready? Count. 1 and 2. Two, three, and four. Nicely done. Let's practice one, one more time. Ready? Go. One and two, three and four. Excellent. Now notice the second measure is the same as the first measure. One and two, three and four. So we can do both of those measures right now. Ready? One and two. Ready? and count. One and two. Three and four. One and two. Three and four. Nicely done. Let's try the third measure. Now the third measure has a one and, but it also has a two and. And then a three and four. So really we're only adding one eighth note. Instead of going one and two, we're going one and two and. So we're just adding this eighth note. The measure other than that is exactly the same. Well, let's practice that. So you guys know that measure anyway. Ready and count. One and two and three and four. Nice, let's do that again. One and two and three and four. Excellent. And we already practiced that last measure, so maybe we're ready to do the whole thing. Let's practice that last one again. Ready? Go. One and two, three. That's right. Maybe we didn't practice it last time, I just showed you. So let's practice that last one again. Ready? Count. One and two, three. Nice. Let's do the last two measures. So we'll do this measure and then this measure. Ready? Count. One and two and three and four. One and two, three. Nice. Did you remember to be silent on that rest? All right. We're going to try the whole thing now. So see if we can do the whole thing and remember at the very end to be silent on the quarter rest. One and two. Ready? Go. One and two. Three and four. One and two. Three and four. One and two and three and four. One and two, three. Excellent, did you get that rest silent there? If you did, great job. If not, don't worry, we're gonna practice it again. This time, try playing your legs as a drum as you're counting with me. One and Two, ready and play. One and two, 
three and four. One and two, three and four. One and two and three and four. One and two, three. Did you get the rest of that time? Good, how about the rest of it? Not too bad? Let's practice one more time and then you can pause the video and practice as many times as you want on your own. And then, well, I'll tell you what's next after that. Let's do it one more time together. Remember, you're gonna count out loud and play your legs at the same time. And remember, our silent rest at the end. One and two, ready and count. One and two, three and four. One and two, three and four. One and two and three and four. One and two, three. Nice. So you can pause the video, practice as much as you need, count it and play it, and then I want you to play on at least three different surfaces. So play it on the couch, play it on the floor, play it on the table, or you could try a chair, you try a stuffed animal, you try one of your toys. If you have any toy instruments at home, it might be really cool to try to play this rhythm on one of your toy instruments. Or if you have any real instruments at home, just make sure to check with mom and dad, see if it's okay to use them. All right, good job. And next week, we're going to do something really, really kind of interesting with this rhythm. So stay tuned and practice, and I'll see you soon. Remember to take care of yourselves, take care of your learning, and take care of others. And hopefully, I'll see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.